sipping tea with the bestie. Hi guys, good morning. So, Jackie wants me to dye her hair again to top it up. So, we're gonna do that. There we go. And we're gonna a little bit of mess of your skin. So, Miss Jacqueline and I, do you care what I called you? Miss <laughs> Jacqueline, for the first time. We're going to do the best friend tag today video later on today. Um, it's like 50 questions about your you best friend. Heart. So, we're gonna film that video in a little bit. Welcome back to Jacqueline's bathroom. Again. This is not okay. Are you ready? No. Do I hold tight? Mm. Mm. Faster! I had to get a grip first. Mm. With the out of hair? Oh my it god. It got lots, look. I wonder if it'll focus. Well, don't say lots! It got a little bit. Okay, let's see. Ready? <laughs> Oh yeah. There was like no hair there, but you should I did mine last night. It's post waxing stuff and then it helps get that excess off. You don't pick my nose. Oh, sure. Fresh as a daisy. <laughs> Wipe it she off says, No, you're not gonna be red after. No, no, you won't be. It'll I am though. But only for a few minutes. I still gotta blow dry my hair. Here, and then you can take that oil off with this. Oh, um, does it hurt? Um, yeah, and I also ate some. Oh, sorry, burns. Hi guys. Hi. Hi. This is my best friend Jacqueline, and I call her Jackie, but you can't. And that's all. So we're going to do the best friend tag. We have 50 questions about each other that we're going to ask each other and see if we can get the answers right. Okay, so, first question. Would you prefer to go to the cinema or watch movies at home? So what do you think I would rather do and what do you think, what do I think you would rather do? I think you would rather watch them at home. Okay, and I think you would rather watch them at home. Yes. And you are correct. <laughs> Do you often watch TV? No for you. No, you watch a lot of YouTube. <laughs> That's correct. Um, so the next question, is there soon some concert to which you would like to go? I think you would like to go see Billie Eilish. And I think you would like to go <laughs> see Billie Eilish. Yep. Yes for me, but also I am going to go see LP in May in Toronto again because I just bought tickets for Valentine's Day for Chrissy, so Shh, don't tell her. Keaton, don't tell, don't tell her. Next question. Do you dance on outings or at parties? Yes, you do. And yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> um, that's correct. Um, what is your G? Dream job. What is your dream job? Your dream job is what you do, I think. And I think your dream job would be a stay-at-home mom. Yeah. And yours is half correct. I love my job. I work for group homes for people with uh, developmental disabilities. Uh, I love my job, but I eventually do want to be a manager to run the residential group homes. So yes, yeah. you're correct. Cool. And you are correct too. Yes. And we're both pretty much living at the dream exactly. life right now. Exactly, <laughs> we're headed that way. All right, um, favorite food. My favorite, I mean your, <laughs> <laughs> your favorite food would be sushi. Mm -hmm. And your favorite food would be plain pasta with yep. water and salt. Yep. Parmesan cheese. Sometimes Alfredo sauce. Sometimes. Okay. That's but yeah, that's to me. exactly what it is. It's new. <laughs> it's newly introduced. Favorite pizza topping? 
yours, yours is cheese. <laughs> yeah. That's all. Yeah. No sauce, no nothing. Yeah. Like literally I could eat plain bread with cheese. <laughs> Your favorite pizza topping would be the works, like everything on it. Yeah. That works for me. Oh. Your favorite ice cream flavor. Yours is vanilla. No. Shit. You get one more guess. Butterscotch. Ew, no. <laughs> no. <Mint> chip. <laughs> really? Yeah. And yours would be the chocolate with like the chocolate and chocolate in it. <laughs> yeah. What do they call it? Like a brownie fudge yeah. mix. Yeah, like all the chocolate. Chocolate. Yeah. Dutch cake. Kiss his mistress. Birthday. <laughs> Your birthday is October 27th. Okay. Yeah. Yours is May 6th. <laughs> so <laughs> May 7th. Yeah. Woo -woo. She got it. All right. <laughs> favorite number. I'm never going to guess your favorite number because I don't even know what numbers you hate. Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to just pick a number and don't cringe. It's under the number. It's under 10. It's under the number. Okay. Yeah. So what do I do my things in? Things of evens, odds, uncles and aunts. <laughs> I'm going to say your favorite number is oh, five, three. I was going to say, did I do that? Yeah. I That's went like I was that like, and I said five. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Three. And your favorite number is seven. Close. It's 27. I was going to guess 27 because that's your birthday. Yeah. But then I was like, I don't know. Basic. We were like half right. <laughs> Middle um, name. Yours is May. Yours is Jill. Yeah. Cassandra. Yes. Good job. Yeah, 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 yeah. Jacqueline Jill went up the hill to find some Cassandra's. <laughs> uh, yeah. She Favorite color. Any. Purple? That's one of them, yeah. Yeah, it's hard. Green. I've been slowly liking a different color lately. And I like black. Me too. My favorite color used to be purple, but then now it's been changing to I'm green. I'm going to say, well, don't tell me. Oh yeah, you didn't answer it. <laughs> I'm going to say green. <laughs> and like a teal, kind of like aqua-y, pastel -y. Yeah. Those are the colors. Wow. My colors in the past couple of years have been changing, so yes. So I have a question. Okay. Instead of this part. Can your best friend cook? So I think Brittany doesn't really cook, so, <laughs> no. I cook amazing. Do you? Yeah, I do. You don't cook me anything. You want me to? Yeah. I cook you, well, you're freaking scary to cook for. You want me but to? All the things I've ever cooked for you, like I've eaten. So like, I you know what I like. Plain pasta. No, but I've also cooked you like chicken. Oh, chicken, and, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And skewers. Yeah, and I can cook stuff if it doesn't require following a recipe. I just cook like my own style. Like I just yeah. cook, like throw in some spices, throw in some of that. I can't bake. I cannot bake. I can't bake either. Everything burns. Ooh, thank you. Thanks, man. Thank you. What superpower would your best friend want to have? Um. To cure mental illness. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> and to be able to read people's minds, but that would help me cure mental illness. But would you really want to know what's on people's no, minds? No, I wouldn't because it would terrify me and then my mental illness would go <laughs> crazy. So no, yeah. you're right, I don't. So yes, we'll just say yes. <laughs> no, so yes, so no. Yes. Absolutely, so yes. yes. I, If I had a superpower, it would be to cure mental illness. And if you had a superpower, I think it would be to take away people's pain. Yeah, sadness. that would be, yeah. How did you know? I don't know. <laughs> um, if they could be an animal, what would your best friend be? I think you would want to be an elephant. Because <laughs> then you could wave your trunk around. You could just be a man. They all like to oh, do yeah. that. Fine, you'd want to be an owl. 
so you could, because you like to be at night. That's it. That actually is my spirit animal, apparently. Oh, really? Yeah. I got you owls for Christmas last year. Mm -hmm. uh, not last year. You got me owl and elephant. Yeah. And I think you would want to be a bird. No, I want to be something that sleeps all the time. Cat. Sloth. I want to be a cat. <laughs> I want to be a cat. A cat. Okay. Because then I could sleep all day and nobody would get mad at me. Or tell me I had to wake up to do something. Just have a cat nap. <laughs> That's why they made it. What is your best friend afraid of? Catch up. Yeah. There is an actual um, name for it. The phobia of ketchup. And I do. I am scared of it. Schizophrenia ketchup, not for me. And then you, what are you afraid of? Belly buttons. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, no. Not many things because maybe spiders? No. Not like ghosts. The basics. I'm scared of spiders, but I'm not like. Yeah, you're not like hyperventilating. Like, I'll kill them. Yeah. Care. You're afraid. I, you are afraid of Maverick getting seriously ill. Mm hmm. That's a rational fear I have. Yeah. What talent or ability does your best friend have? Ooh. You can pop those hips out of place like nobody's business. <laughs> <laughs> hobble around. Oh my gosh, yeah. Fibromyalgia and bursitis. <laughs> No, I don't know. Do you have any special, like, weird talents? Um, you can sing. Mm, I could roll my tongue over. Can't everybody do that? Uh-uh. You do it. Mm, kind of. Am I not good enough? Oh, but I can also, like, get my thumb far or closer to here than most people can. Can they see it? I don't know if they can. Wait, I can do this in my face. Yeah, you can do more than me. Thank but you. most people can't get it very far. Can't even. <laughs> that should be the thumbnail. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> yeah, right? Um, <laughs> your uh, special talent is you can do a clover with your tongue, can't you? The no. three thing? like. No. I can't do it. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. <laughs> <laughs> I can, pretty much. I, I can when I look in a mirror to do it. Okay. Um, what's your special talent? What, what special thing can you do? <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah! I did know that! But not with this one. This with this one. This little weird owl. Not a little weird owl. <sighs> what is your best friend's most embarrassing childhood memory? Well, we only knew each other once we started high school. So what's your most embarrassing high school memory? I don't know that one. I don't know, because nobody was really there when it happened. Exactly. But, like, I got, like, my, um, Didn't my you stuff, like, fall? raided oh. in the office and, like, got so suspended did I. for, like, three days. And yeah. I didn't even, it was Near wasn't Mr. Miller's funeral? Around there? Uh, no. I wasn't there when he died. Oh, yeah, you were already gone. Yeah. But I also got, like, this guy named Matt, like, had, like, this ice chunk, and he, like, whipped it at my eye. And everyone like saw it and I like fell down to the ground and I like hit my open eye with like the ice and I had to like go to the hospital. For real? Mm-hmm. Oh, I wasn't there for that. Um, okay. And then mine, I'll just answer it. My most embarrassing. I was wearing a kilt because we went to a Catholic high school um, and I was walking up the stairs to the science hallway. You know how it was secluded? And I tripped. the stairs, right? Yeah. And I tripped going up the stairs and I was wearing my kilt that day. I had underwear on, obviously, but I fell and <laughs> there was people behind me. So that was my most embarrassing high school memory that I can think of. But yeah, it's pretty it was very embarrassing. Oh my God, I didn't know that happened. Yeah, it was like grade nine. Oh, remember? Like, the beginning. Freaking, was it, was it Ronnie? I don't know, somebody like, smacked my leg so freaking hard when I had my kilt on and I had like a hand, hand welt yeah. of like purple and black because mm -hmm. we used to like wear our kilts all the time. Yeah. It was, that was embarrassing. It's like walking around with like marks on me. 
What does your best friend love most about herself? I think you love your beautiful smile. That's not too shabby. <laughs> I actually love my hair the most, but I don't currently love my hair the most. I know you don't right now, it's that's why. going through changes, as you can see here. Going see all these short change. pieces, as you probably see them in all my freaking videos? That's why I didn't answer your hair, because I usually would have <laughs> answered your hair. Yeah. Because I know you It's growing back from it. postpartum hair loss, but at least it's growing back. Postpartum hair loss is a real thing. It happens. No one told me about it. Yeah, sorry. I forgot about it. Po I just remembered the post or the pre-partum hair growth was amazing. Mm -hmm. um, what do I love most about myself? I would say you love most about yourself is your eyes. Yes, yeah. it is my beautiful eyes. Mm -hmm. I think they're beautiful. They are. They are, they are. What does your best friend hate the most about their self? I think you hate your teeth. Yes. And I think you hate... Well, fat body. <laughs> no! Beautiful. Love your body. Everybody it's love just, your body for who it is. But you asked what, what we is. hated and now. I know, I know, I know. That's what she was gonna say. But right now you hate your hair. Mm -hmm. Because it's going through changes. Mm -hmm. But everybody love your body for who it is, what it is, what it's made, if it's made children, if it's gone from weight loss to weight gain or weight gain to weight loss. Just love your body. Brittany's like <laughs> Love yourself. And love other people. Has your best friend had any surgeries? Yep. You had surgery on your stomach. Yes. And my teeth. I you did? My wisdom oh, your teeth wisdom extracted. I didn't realize that kind of gets a surgery. Technically, yeah, because they put me under. See. So then, other than that, no, you have not had surgery. Other than your teeth. Because we said, you, we said no to the teeth. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 a cesarean. She <laughs> had a C-section, so yes, because Maverick needed to come out. And he wasn't coming out the other way. He's a big boy. <laughs> He's breaking that. That's fine. It's okay. Oh, my God. No, don't worry about well, it. I think there's another it. one. <laughs> right? The satisfying. It's so, like, crispy. Does your best friend take any medications? <laughs> Skip. Okay. All right. Yep. <laughs> Yes. Yes and yes. Yes. We do. Carry on. I take some medication for us. I suffer with a mental illness. Um, a. A. Bipolar 2 disorder. I also have borderline personality disorder. Obsessive compulsive Ooh, personality disorder. And OCD. So yes, I do take medication to manage my bipolar 2 disorder. Um, I also take for my anxiety, which is my OCD. I do take a medication for that. And other than that, I go to talk therapy for my borderline personality disorder and my obsessive compulsive personality disorder. And it's well managed and I feel good and happy. And voila. And mine's just for anxiety, depression, managing all that. And you talked about stuff. that in one of your early videos. Yeah. That you went through some of that. Yeah. So go, I'll link that video down below. Can we pause it for it's a called second? getting personal. Does your best friend prefer rock or country? Country. Country. Yeah. <laughs> Does your best friend have a nickname? Well, and what is it's it? It's Jackie, but you don't like it. No. <laughs> That's all I know you by. No. But nobody else can call her that. No one what do you can mean call no? Me Jackie. I hate the name Jackie, but what do you, what does Maverick call me? Oh, Auntie Jack Jack. Yeah, Jack Jack. And yours is Bert Nay. <laughs> <laughs> That's from me, though. Bert Nay. So Brit would be your nickname, but Bert Nay. Mona. Mona. Ah, ah. You don't do growl at people. What do you growl for? Big dog head and video. Does your breast, breast, does your breast friend have any piercings, tattoos, or both? Okay, so we can't look at each other. Mommy, can you, you play with his cars? Have a nose ring. You have earrings. Let me guess. You have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
11 earrings. I have one, two, three, four, five, six earrings. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I was just saying earrings. I wasn't done here. Twelve. Belly button, lip. <laughs> no, because I only have one, two, three, four, four, five. Six, seven. I have seven earrings. Eight, nine. This nine. one's this one's closed though, so it doesn't like. I lost it when I was in Cuba, and then hasn't been able to. I, when it's I got piercing home, though, like you yeah, had it's it still piercing, yeah. yeah. And then I tattoos. Have, you have. I'll count while you count. Okay. Oh my God. How many do you have? You have one on your arm, one on your leg. One down your back, one on your shoulder, one on your neck, one behind your ear. Your arms? Yeah, so that'll count as one. Do you have one here? Yeah. Do you have more? Mm-hmm. Um... You have a thigh one? Mm hmm. And. Well, you had one, but it got removed. <laughs> so, yep. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know anymore. My ankle. Oh. And then I oh, also. Oh, you got a rock somewhere. Yeah, I got the rocks. Then I have behind my other ear the dots, the pride oh, dots. Yeah, I forgot about that. And I was there for the that. back of my arm. Remember I said I... that first. The bruised one. It's not bruised. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. So then yes. Then you got him the all right, except except you forgot the the pride dots yes. and my rocks on my ankle. Yes. But yes, I got the rocks as mental health because they're staggered like this, and if one rock was to fall, then they would all crumble. So it's as a support system. All together, they make a whole. And yes, you have piercings and tattoos. So piercings would be four for earrings because you have two holes on each i think or just one hole maybe just one just do one do you want to know oh two yeah i see two but there was three and there then was the top, yeah and then the top sir pierce there's two there oh two there yeah on this side. three three Two. Yeah. Two. But yeah, whenever I see you, I only ever see you with like the pretty one. And like, I had my dangly. tragus pierced before. Oh yeah, I see the hole. Oh, I also have my tragus. I forgot about that. Hmm. But when we do tragus, tragus. um, you have tragus. your nose pierced. I think you had your tongue done at once. I did. And your belly button. Yep. And then tattoos. Okay. So, you have your whole shoulder piece. Mm -hmm. You have Mavericks. Footprint, or do you have his handprint? You have his foot. Neither. Oh, that's that's Franco. <laughs> Mom, by God. You have your elephant. Yeah. You have the matching one with me on your back of your arm. Mm -hmm. You have the on your shoulder here the um, the note that Franco wrote you with the bird. Mm -hmm. and Maverick, then you're you making have... a mess. Uh oh. I think that's all you have. Or no, you have two more, but where are they? And what are they? What was the first tattoo I ever got? Oh yeah, your foot. Mm -hmm. You have your foot. And then I got another one. Another done. one on your foot. No. Didn't you? I got another one done when I got this sh this one done. Oh, that's why I considered it oh, the whole thing all just one. No, it's you... a different spot. Oh. Something for Maverick? Yeah. Yeah, and then you got the flowers and everything. Yeah, but it's a different. Oh, so those are two separate tattoos? Yeah. Okay, so you have Maverick up here. No, here. Oh, yeah, that's more recent. I remember. That's when I yes. got this done. Oh, because I wasn't there two for Two separate this one. times. Yeah. Like two separate tattoos, yeah. but same. But same pricing. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. By the way, I did your bruise. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> bruise. I'm just going to call it the bruise. How many brothers or sisters do I have and what are their names? Okay, so okay, you have Alex, Sarah, 
Adam, Jen. What's her name? Sa Sandy. Yeah. Okay. And then my brother. Well, I said Adam. Yeah. What's I don't that? know your other brother's name. Corey. Corey. Yeah. And you missed Krista. Oh, I sorry, think, Krista. I think, I think. I didn't say Krista. No. Okay. Her twin. I so there's eight, eight of us twin. in total. Adam, Sarah, Alex, Krista, Jacqueline, Jen, Corey, Sandy. And we all have lots of children. <laughs> and you have Barry and Tyler. Yep. 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 That we know of. Just kidding. <laughs> Would I take in a homeless person if I was asked? Brittany, no you would not. <laughs> would I? Yeah. Yeah. I would help them find a place, but it wouldn't be my place. Yeah, you would help them. Yeah. But you I wouldn't, wouldn't bring, bring them home. In. No. I would. I know you would. You've yeah. almost done it. Pretty to a, To a half homeless person. You've had a few people live with you. But yeah, I've had people live with me through home share, through my work, um, through a program. See, and I would tell you before, share, I would yeah. never do that. Yeah. But like... Anyway. It's good that you do. Yeah. Oh Were we doing something? Does my car have a name? Ooh, girl. Yes, but I don't know it. And your car does not have a name. Yes, it does. I know it does. I don't remember it, though. You so know it does? Yeah, because we talked about it, because my car has a name, too. But it, my new car has a name. name. Big Bertha? <laughs> Just kidding. That's not it. That's oh, not it. I it's Evelyn. We must have talked about this before because mine's Eve. Oh yeah, we did talk about it. Yeah, mine's Evelyn mine's and Eve. Eve and yours is, yours is Evelyn and Eve. No, that's... <laughs> Mama, what? Mine's Evelyn and Eve, you know, I just took both names. Mine is Evelyn and yours is Eve. Yes, yeah. we did talk about it. Do I take my car to have it washed or leave you it dirty until it rains? <laughs> you used to, we used to, go and have our cars washed. When we had... Like, all Morris. the time, right? Now, no. It can be washed when it rains. Yeah. She answered for both of us. Yeah. What does your best friend take in their coffee or tea? I would say in your tea, you take two Splenda and whatever cream or milk or almond milk or anything that's on hand, about one or two. I just splash. Splash. Yeah. I would say you take one stevia yeah. and a little bit of milk or cream, but lately black coffee. Yes. So in my tea it would be that, and in my coffee it would be that. But now I've been drinking my coffee black, and my tea still is the one sweetener. Yes, yes, and yes. One. Or stevia. I don't like Splenda. Stevia is good. In tea. Stevia is bad in coffee. It tastes gross. Mm -hmm. Ugh. But yeah, so coffee black. All right. Okay, well that's it for today's video, guys. Hope Hit. you enjoyed it. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, is it because we're saying goodbye? Hit the red subscribe button down below. Become a part of the fam before you go. Hit the notification bell beside it if you don't want to miss our upcoming vlogs and videos. We hope you guys have the rest, a uh, good rest of your day, and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.